Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, it's your girl C Chronicles. Thank you very much for joining me today. If you're new on this channel, I do fragrance reviews, I do DIY, I do lifestyle videos and much, much more. So I hope you do consider subscribing after watching this video. Uh, to my returning subscribers, thank you very much for coming along and always supporting your girl. I'm back again with another Paris Corner uh, find which I uh, have had in my collection for a while. I have um, haven't been keen to do this, um, you know, comparison offset because um, the fragrance in question is this one and this one. So to those that follow my channel, you will know how I feel about Alien by Boudle. You will know how I feel about this fragrance. So anyway, for the sake of this video, I bought this fragrance so that I can do a review. I've had this fragrance for a while and I've been just, you know, thinking, okay, let me give it a test run and see, right? So we are talking about Adin by Paris Corner Sense. I will insert a uh, photo of the packaging, right? I think it's almost a no brainer. You can see what they were trying to do here. So Paris Corner is a clone house or a dupe house or, you know, whichever way you want to, um, uh, uh, say it, um, but they do fragrances inspired by, right? The only thing, the only problem I have with them is they tend to replicate even the pre, uh, the presentation, which is a bit pushing it too far. But anyway, we're here to talk about the contents of this one. Adin by Paris Corner. The top notes are Sambic Jasmine, Cashmere Woods, that's in the mid, and then it's got uh, some white amber right three simplistic notes which happen to be in this one as well okay uh i know this one they've just put woods you know but everything else uh, is more or less the same if i'm not mistaken i didn't put the notes down right so anyway i am going to tell you what i think of this fragrance right um an alien lovers don't come for me please i know if you love a fragrance this is not intended to hurt anybody or to rubbish anybody's tastes or anything like that. I just have a love-hate relationship or a more of a hate relationship with Alien. It just, to me, is headache-inducing. It's a jasmine bomb. It's It just feels like a mixture of some... It just feels like a chemical that should be in a lab. Something in it is quite annoying. Um, to me, that is. But that's not to say other people don't like it i know it's one of the very popular fragrances so anyway the comparison i'm going to do for this chippy is this is a simplistic interpretation of alien right it feels like an alien watered down it's a sort of alien that if you're like myself and you don't like the original alien possibly you could send this um but it does share that similar note that is that feels like you know, there is a note in Alien that feels like a like a pile of magazines, whether it's the Jasmine or the way they have interpreted the Jasmine. It feels like a pile of magazines, brand new magazines that are in the magazine printing company. And that there is something about it that that's in here that just reminds me of brand new magazine or brand new, not even papers, but magazine that ink in the magazine. It does share the same with this one right it does share the, the 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 jasmine as well but this is a little this is a bit headache less headache inducing than this one this one does tend to give me a headache this one projects beast mode which is what it should because it's you know it is a good quality fragrance uh however you know this one like i said feels like a watered down uh, fragrance in terms of say rating i would say Let's say this is a 10 out of 10, which it should be anyway, because it's the original. This one is copying it. This I would put at about 7 out of 10, uh, because what they managed to get out of this was this is less insensitive. This is less headache inducing. This is a bit watered down. This you can wear all weather. Uh, it does feel like Alien. 100% feels like Alien. So if you are annoyed by Alien, you know, that what i've been talking about that overwhelming bookstore kind of like a dark deep insensy feel um that alien has like a it feels like it's got some chemical in it that should be dangerous that shouldn't be that shouldn't be recommended for the nose i don't know what to say about it but if you you know like this one or, or no if you don't if you love this one then i know that's fine 
but all i'm saying is this one is kind of like an um toned down version of whatever is going on here but of course if you walked past somebody they will think you're wearing the same thing this feels like alien everything about it feels like alien but it's what it does that feels less like alien if anything makes sense in what i'm saying i know i'm going all over the going round and round in circles you know this to me feels like a chemic there's just something in it that is super super annoying whether it's the jasmine and this is to me like i said it feels like some chemical that's supposed to be in a lab something in it just protrudes that i just don't quite love you know and the same happens here but this is a much softer version of it so yes today i've been talking about this dupe called aideen and uh, if it, if i found sound like i'm all over the place it's because i just bought this for the purposes of you know doing this video i am not a fan of or big on uh, this particular fragrance or this particular fragrance but for the sake of my viewers I thought okay I'm gonna buy a fragrance like this and then I am going to tell you what I think of it you know because maybe some somebody might find this information useful so yeah Aideen uh, by Paris Corner Aideen Pandora Sense by Paris Corner uh, does actually feel like this alien that they're trying to replicate but it's a softer more watered down version uh, a more wearable version a less cloying version i don't get a, a headache out of this in as much as i don't like it but i still don't get a headache so i think you know for somebody who likes alien and they feel maybe it's a bit too much for them you know it might be worth trying it doesn't break the bank and again this is not a paid promotion this is just me sharing information uh, to you uh fellow fragrance lovers so i hope you did enjoy uh this video you do let me know what you think do you like alien are you like me i'm an angel girl i like um thierry mugler's uh, i like mugler's uh, fragrances but i'm an angel girl so some people say you know if you're an angel girl you find alien a bit tricky if you're an early alien girl you find angel a bit tricky so i'm an angel girl so i'm not quite dissing all his fragrances but i find alien a bit challenging a bit headache inducing a bit heavy for me and uh, it's one of those fragrances like i say i will keep because i got it as a gift and it's a beautiful bottle overall but in terms of whether or not i'm going to wear this more i think this is going to be a fragrance that if my friends come over they can spray it as much as they want and i'm just going to be happy knowing it's in my collection thank you very much for joining me today it's been your girl c chronicles i hope you do subscribe and i hope you do tell me what you think in the comment section do share this video remember to like and comment and uh you know i hope i did not offend any alien lovers anyway guys remember smelling good is a form of good manners cheers <laughs>